Roosevelt's Rough Riders consisted of many Ivy League scholars and ex-Confederate soldiers. They trained in San Antonio, Texas on May 30th, 1898 and deployed to Cuba on June 7th. He allowed two men to film the battle. The Rough Riders took the town of Daiquiri without shots being fired. They took a seven mile hike to the town of Zaiboni. They fell under sniper fire. Luckily, they were supported by Buffalo soldiers. Roosevelt fought furiously and was unhurt. The Rough Riders sustained many injuries. Roosevelt was disturbed by the amount of deaths. He had to argue with his superiors to get extra beads for his men. For Roosevelt's bravery, he was promoted colonel. On July 1st, 1898, Roosevelt and his Rough Riders joined the march to San Juan Hill. They were forced to take cover from bombing. Boom. Boom. By early morning, they moved on. The Rough Riders fell under fire. Many were afraid to charge. Roosevelt, walking softly but carrying a big stick, led the charge through the front lines and took the hill. Roosevelt felt a great feeling of loss for his fallen comrades. On August 8th, 1898, the Rough Riders returned to New York with a hero's welcome. Roosevelt is now a man of peace.